many mysteries, but few answers. Stop there! Who are you? One who would be your guide. Tell me, what do you remember from before? My general, a fierce battle. And then I was imprisoned in darkness. Hmm. But now, you are free. What are you? Come, there is much I would show you to prepare you for the challenges that lie ahead. This place is so strange. Where are we? Where is less important than when? Many thousands of years ago, when our world was young. Azeroth was home to the ancestors of dragons. Primitive beasts ruled by primal instincts. Yet, there were a few in whom the spark of intelligence was lit. Who thought spoke and felt more deeply than the rest. What does this have to do with me? Were it not for them, your people would not be. From these proto-dragons, there arose the monster Galakrond. Whose insatiable hunger would have consumed us all. When the fate of our kind was at stake, we five overcame the instincts of fear and self-preservation and united to battle the Leviathan. We? So, you were one of these? <laughs> bravery, risking everything to save the world, we were granted a gift of the Titans, transformed into something greater. Together, we became the Aspects, leaders of the Dragon Flights. The protectors of Azeroth. In time, we took on visages like this to better commune with the younger races. Why have you shown me this? I am Nosdormu. I was aspect of the Bronze Flight. It is my fate to see all of time, but now a threat to our world approaches. An ancient enemy has returned. You will play a part in the events to come, and you will have to make a difficult choice, as we did. I am not like you. No. My story is already written, but yours and that of all Drak fear is only beginning to unfold. Commander of the Drakthir. You know of us. You are a race of fierce warriors, unlike anything Azeroth has seen in many an age. In time, 
You may become as mighty as we once were. Once? What happened? The desire for power carries peril. We were blind to the darkness in our midst. Behold, the Dragon Isles. In the time after our ascension, we Aspects sought to create a beacon of hope for all the world. Beautiful. Notharian, my general. Indeed, we all had our roles to play. Guided by Alex Straza, our conscience, our heart, we all became as close as clutchmates, or so it seemed. For we could not hear the whispers of corruption that tempted one of our own. When demons invaded our world, we aspects went forth to protect it as we always had. Not knowing whether we would ever again see the shores of home. Our brother Naltharion led our defense against the invaders. But for the first time, we found our strength inadequate. And we grew desperate. So when Naltharion assured us that with our help, he could forge a weapon to win the war. We placed our trust in him. And we renewed our battle against the demons, only to have Naltharion, who now took the name Deathwing, turn on his own kind. could not foresee this betrayal, for we simply did not want to believe. Even after all this time, the pain of his treachery is far worse than the scars he left us with. That is not the leader I remember. How do I know it was not you who provoked him? You miss much during your confinement, but the sands of time Reveal all truths, child, even bitter ones. Trust your eyes. When the champions of Azeroth faced Deathwing for the last time, he was so consumed by madness that he could not imagine what we would sacrifice to stop him. That the weapon we had helped him forge would become the means of his destruction. Was there no other way? Deathwing would have destroyed this world. To stop him, we aspects relinquished our power. Our immortality, our guardianship of Azeroth itself. A fair trade, I believe. You want something from me, don't you? It is my gift and my burden to travel the pathways of time. But there is one crucial moment that has long remained hidden from me. And only you can lead me there. Nostromo, wait! You have led me through all these moments in time. Yet now you ask me to guide you? There is a blind spot 
in my vision. Of a time before Nalfarian's corruption. And I believe it centers upon you. I must know why. Seek him out in your memory. It was my honor to command a battalion. We executed Neltharion's will precisely. Our devotion and discipline were unmatched. The Titan Artifact? That must be the source of your unity. This was an ancient magic that bound you to his will. Would you not sacrifice yourselves at his whim? We were soldiers. There were many threats to the world. And here was the greatest. The Tribalists. That is Razageth, the Storm Eater. One of the leaders of the Primalist Rebellion. He struck without warning, without honor. And I lost many friends this day. We fell back. Regrouped. Then, everything became jumbled, confused. The artifact destroyed, and the order magic which had united the Drakthir was dispelled. How then was Razageth defeated? Imprisoned. Why did we sleep for so long? If he could no longer control the Drakthir, he would have deemed you a risk. No. We laid down our lives for him. He was proud of us. Why would he... Stop this, Sand! I cannot see! Because you do not want to. Yet you can only become more than you are if you confront your past. God, we even existed. It would have been kinder to simply destroy us. I am sorry, my young friend. We had to know the truth. But do not despair. I now believe that Neltharion locked you away because of what you might become. What we might achieve, free of his control. And now, you are free. This world has much to offer, and you will have a part to play in the events to come. You spoke of an ancient enemy's return. It is Razageth and the Primalists. That is why we were awakened. 
It seems that Neltharion yet had a purpose for you. But he is gone. You must decide which path you will take. Which story you will tell. My story will be my own.